Oh my, what are those guys doing? I mean, okay. Hello everybody, I'm Evil Rabbit. We're here on Car X Drift Racing Online with the new update, and we're here on Shadow Realm. And we're going to be getting sideways in the Z, maybe throw some tandems. Make sure you guys follow me on all social media. All will in the description box below. Let's get into it. If you guys remember, I drove this track in a set of Corsa. That hard flick though, this car can flick really hard. Yep. Jeez. That transition rate though. I still think the 180 so far is still my favorite car. The Z though, if you want quick, aggressive, snappy transitions. The Z is definitely uh, where you want to go. And now we're here on the car extra racing with the update, and we decided to bring this the Z out to see what it's like here in uh, car X. And so far, uh, I'm actually digging this track and the way the Z is driving at the moment. We need to see if we can get with some people and try and run some tandems. If you guys are on PC with this update, let me know what you guys are thinking about it. Because uh, first impressions of this, I'm uh, having a little bit of fun. See if we can't file in behind these guys. A lot of smoke. This is almost just like in a settle lobby now. Minus the physics feel of a settle, but not feeling too bad here on my R12. I don't have good, super good wheel settings yet because I've never really been able to run my Moza bases here in Car X before. They didn't really want to work, right? But now for some reason, everything's working correctly. Oh, there's no collisions. Well, I guess that's a good thing because I would have, uh, Hit that guy. So another thing I'm very oh that guy's dead. <laughs> another thing I'm very curious is why people do uh, low tire grip settings here in Car X because my car is not set up for that at all. So I definitely need to get some better. Tunes in my cars. Let's see if we can't give him a little bit of a lead. Oh, glitch! That was a pretty big glitch. Somebody must have came in to the lobby because that was a bit of a pretty gnarly glitch. Ooh, don't try and change views while you're driving. Go up into this higher view and see if we can't drive in this high view. This is hard. Yep. It's really hard to drive in that high view. We really need to get our uh, first person settings situated. Or bring out the VR. But overall impressions on this new update, I'm actually very, like I said, excited to see some breath of fresh air into the Car X uh, PC settings. With all the modding and everything available, you would think this didn't take as long as it did to come out, but I'm super excited that it's out. And the Shadow Realm car, or Shadow Realm track is going to make for a lot of really cool tandem lobbies, because all the other tracks were... Gotta get a little bit stale. Yeah, I really need to work on these wheel settings. See if I can't dial in a better wheel setting. If you guys have wheel settings for the game, let me know down in the comments section because I'd be very curious to see what people are running for in-game settings and stuff like that. Well, we get the hang of it now. Nowhere near the line I need to be in, but... Mm -hmm. 
not sure where I'm getting all these weird glitches and stuff. Could just be, uh, since this is kind of beta-ish. Let me see if we can't get behind somebody. Oh, oh, okay. So we do have some collisions. That Corolla is aggressive, to say the least. Yeah, I definitely need to uh, get some good tunes on these cars also because I feel like I'm lacking in the tune department for on a wheel right now because I was playing this game on controller for a while. Like I need to get some wheel tunes and some good settings for these cars. I think I see Han's car up there. Wait, oh, get, come back! So like I said, if you guys want to keep seeing car let me know down in the comment section down below. I very appreciate it. If you guys aren't subscribed, I appreciate if you guys subscribed to the channel. I appreciate all the support. And you guys come back for more videos. I'm going to turn my lights off. Oh, that's super. Just sit on my head in grass. Oh my! What are those guys doing? I mean, okay. We got a bit of a Shadow Realm train going. And I'm just back here bathing in smoke. Acting like a noob because I'm totally not set up for this. These guys are just like blowing and I'm over here not. Yep, definitely need to get some dialing in with wheel setting stuff as you can see. I think I might be a controller. I cannot see. I saw that Corolla come in. <laughs> so let's go take a look at some of the other tracks that are in the workshop. So another track that I'm super excited about is this carrier track because if you guys follow DMVC in a set of course, you guys know that this was one of the competition tracks they ran. So it's definitely a fun track. We're gonna go full send. Nice gear hit. Definitely not wide enough. That wall really hurts. That wall comes out and bites you. So I think you guys have some good tunes let me know down in the comments where you think uh names of tunes if you guys have got a tune throw it up because i'd be very curious to download some tunes from the tune workshop yeah because this car is not uh not ideal right now but this track looks pretty sick and being able to have, like I said, a breath of fresh air with some new tracks and stuff like that here in Car X Online makes the game worth coming back to and playing on. We gotta try and get a good solid entry. Good solid entry and a good uh, run here to end this episode off. Make sure you guys follow me on all social media. I'll follow the description box below. That was a little bit better. No! Till that part. A wall tap. Oh, I forgot that was an inner clip there. Or inner touch and go, inner clip. Well, that wasn't too bad of a run. We're gonna do it again because that wasn't too, too terrible. We almost had it in a complete run. This track is actually still pretty tricky. I wanna get the in car settings and all that, but like I said, a good tune I think would make this 
handles so much better. Alright. One final run. Too much break. Wrong angle. Yep. Wrong angle. Too much break. Wrong line. Totally. So that'll do it here for this episode here on Car X Drift Racing, which is something that I never thought I'd really come back in on, but this update is making this game seem much more promising. If we had a bit of a physics update. So as always, uh, thank you guys for coming back and watching. I'm Evil Rabbit. I'll see you guys on the track.